Welcome to an introduction to TimberScan. This presentation will provide a basic overview of the TimberScan system. For a more detailed evaluation, please join our live webinar, which we host every Wednesday at 10 a.m. and at 4 p.m. Eastern Time. To sign up, simply go to our website, www.timberscan.com. TimberScan is an automated AP approval, routing, and management system that we designed exclusively for Timberline, now known as Sage 300 Construction and Real Estate. It will create a paperless process eliminating invoice copies, approval folders, lost and misplaced invoices, filing cabinets, express mail fees, and a host of other useless expenses. TimberScan automatically routes invoices to the right approver based on your company's business rules. It cuts the approval process by more than 50%. Some clients have reported that approvals that used to take weeks now take days with TimberScan. It's easy to use and quick to implement. Most clients are operational within a matter of a few days. It provides exceptional reporting because it's reporting both on the Timberline and TimberScan databases, giving you the data that's up to the minute. TimberScan is a proven system. We have over 12,000 users in more than 700 companies. We are also an authorized Sage development partner and have been since 2005. We get new versions of Sage Timberline Office months before they're released to the clients, allowing us to fully test our system and ensure compatibility with new releases. The best way to think of TimberScan is as a separate pending approval system to Timberline. It's fully integrated with the Timberline system and AP data entry in TimberScan is exactly the same as Timberline, providing the same lookups, warnings, and error messages. The foundation of TimberScan is your business rules. When you set up TimberScan, you define your users and you define how you want invoices routed. Once that's set, then all other data is coming from the Timberline database. The workflow is very simple. Invoices are scanned in TimberScan, we have an optional capture module, which will read the invoices and extract the data. Once the invoices are scanned, they flow to data entry. Once they are entered in data entry, they go to the right approver. And once they've gone through the approval process, they flow into Timberline. Now you'll get a chance to see TimberScan in action. We will start with our scanning process. The first step is to get invoices into TimberScan. We call this the acquire image function. Invoices can either come in the mail, in which case you scan them, or if they come in via email, you can simply drag and drop them into TimberScan. TimberScan controls your scanners, gives you editing capabilities so you can clean up and fix invoices. And once you're done with reviewing the invoices, simply Click on Process, and they're available to your data entry group. Now we will review the data entry process. Data entry in TimberScan is exactly the same as data entry in Timberline. If you know your vendor code, you can type it in. If you don't, you can simply type in the vendor name, and you can look it up from the Timberline database. If there's any Timberline warnings, they will automatically pop up. The distribution grid is exactly the same as what you would see in Timberline. If you know your job or property number, you can type it in or you can simply look it up on the list. Cost codes and GL account codes come up as well, and you can choose them from the list that's coming from Timberline. Now, one big difference between TimberScan and Timberline is in TimberScan, you don't have to complete the coding you can leave the cost code and category or the GL account code blank and it will still find the right approver. TimberScan does an exceptional job when it comes to controlling commitments. You can look up your commitments from your list. TimberScan will tell you what the total committed value is, what's been invoiced. It will also tell you what's still in the approval process and what's left as a balance. 
With TimberScan, you will never have a situation where an invoice comes in that brings you over your committed value without you knowing about it. TimberScan also has a workflow for any supporting documents. Supporting documents can be receiving tickets, packing slips, lien waivers, uh, manifests, uh, anything that's associated with an invoice, anything that you want your approver to have with the invoice. Uh, these can be pre-filtered to the vendor job that you're working on, and once selected, they will be attached to the invoice record so that the approver not only has a copy of the invoice, but the supporting document as well. Now we will see how invoices are approved in TimberScan. Once the invoices are data entered, they automatically flow to the right approver. The approver will get an email notification and they would sign on to TimberScan and they can start approving all their invoices or they can filter them based on various criteria. If there are any notes or messages from accounting, they will automatically pop up so the approver knows what the status is on this invoice. The approver now has all the documentation they need to start reviewing this invoice to see if they're ready to approve it. The invoice is there as well as the supporting document. They can view the supporting documents side by side. If this isn't their invoice, they can simply click on reject and send it back to data entry to be recoded. Note that this invoice isn't completely coded. It still found the approver based on the business rules. Now, if the approver has the rights to complete the coding, they can simply type the coding in or they can click on list. It will give them a list of the regular cost codes from Timberline and they can find the appropriate cost code and category. And once they're done, they can complete the coding approve the invoice, and go to the next invoice. If the invoice was coded, the approver can simply point to the cost code and it'll tell you what the cost code is, what the budget is, what's been invoiced, and what's in the approval process. If the approver needs to put notes on an invoice, they can record comments, or if they want to put a notation right on the invoice, TimberScan has sticky notes capability where they can just simply point to an area and type in whatever they want to say. And that becomes a permanent part of the record once it's saved. If the approver needs to review cost to date and they have the authority to do so, they can simply click on this job button and get a report. TimberScan reporting is exceptional. Not only is it giving you the information that's been posted to Timberline, but it also gives you the information that's still in the approval process. This gives you data that's up to the minute. While reviewing this information, if you don't recognize something, you can simply point to it, like a GL account code, or a cost code, or a job, or a commitment. It gives you a breakdown of what that is. Now, if you need to look up something specific, you can simply click on this column and pull up whatever you need to see and it'll pre-filter it. There's a lot of additional filtering capabilities within TimberScan. Uh, you can view the detail uh, images as well as any supporting documents that are there. Uh, once you find what you want, there's all kinds of reporting capabilities and the ability to put things into Excel. The beauty of TimberScan is that this reporting comes free with the system. It doesn't require you to buy anything additional from Timberline. Once the approver is done reviewing this invoice, they can then either approve it, they can skip it, they can put it on hold, they can put it on hold in AP. Once they approve it, it can go to a second approver or a third approver. And once it's gone through the approval process, it flows directly into Timberline. It's a live link to the Timberline database. The invoices and all the supporting documents can also be viewed inside of the Timberline database. In Timberline, you can see the invoices in either AP, Job Cost, GL, Information Assistant, or Project Management. 
you can see the invoices by running an inquiry. This is an AP transaction inquiry. And once you drill down to the invoice level, you'll be able to see the invoice detail. We are now at the invoice level. TimberScan automatically creates this paperclip attachment. And once you click on this, it will open up the invoice. Not only does TimberScan capture the invoice document, but it creates a complete package of pertinent information. TimberScan automatically creates an approval page which shows who received the invoice, when it was entered, who approved it, and who reviewed it and posted it to Timberline. It also includes a copy of any supporting documents like purchase orders, lien waivers, manifests, and even a copy of the check is part of the package. You saw how TimberScan attaches images directly into the Timberline database. We are pleased to announce TimberScan AIM, our advanced image management module, which will expand Timberline's capabilities to handle all your document requirements. Documents that you want to see in Timberline will be there as attachments. They will be available in job cost, payroll, property management, and any other module. It will also handle non-Timberline documents as well. We are releasing this module at the end of this year. Thank you for this opportunity to show you TimberScan. If you need additional information, you can contact our sales manager, Sandra Readers. Thank you and have a great day.